Yo! What's up, YouTube? Man, it's kind of dark, man. That's kind of sucks. Uh, sorry if you can't really see me. I think it's about the rain uh, here. I don't know. But anyways, I'm on my way to go see Baby Driver. I'm not a baby driver. I'm a, I'm a grown bearded man driver. That's what I am. But yo, man, um, that's pretty loud. Um, yeah, so I wanted to talk about right quick before I get to the theater. I wanted to talk about Spider-Man Homecoming. Great freaking reviews. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. I am freaking hyped. I'm so hyped, so ready. At first, man, I wasn't excited for a new Spider-Man film, but I'm really glad to see that it's getting excellent reviews. Uh, I just watched a review from Grace. I'm not trying to watch a lot of reviews, man. I'm doing reviews myself. Uh, I have a few of them up on my channel right now. Please go check those out. Drop a like on those videos. Uh, comment, if you will. Uh, but yeah, man, I'm trying to do reviews myself, so I'm really trying to refrain from viewing other people's reviews to have their opinions sort of uh, kind of have their opinions affect my opinions of a particular film. So I'm really trying to avoid that. But her great <laughs> Grace's review of Spider-Man Homecoming is really good. I usually like her reviews. I, re I usually trust her and I usually do agree with her. And, uh, you know, she said it was great. But one of the things I really like that she said about it, she said that the final act was great and it was consistent with with the rest of the film i am so happy to hear that because it is really hard for movies to nail those final acts and sometimes they falter wonder woman is an example of that wonder woman did falter in his final act in my opinion but that was a great movie regardless uh but spider-man to hear that the final act, final act does not falter and that it holds consistent holds strong until the very end i am excited for that man Woo! Hey, and I just got to say, man, to all the freaking Tobey Maguire haters all of a freaking sudden, because when Andrew Garfield came out, I guarantee you everybody was praising Tobey for his performance as Spider-Man. But now Tom Holland's out and now everybody want to trash not only Andrew Garfield, but Tobey Maguire. Lay off my man Tobey Maguire, man. He did a great uh, Peter Parker and a great Spider-Man. You we can debate on, you know, Peter Parker, but he did a fantastic Spider-Man. Honestly, forget that. No, man, I think he did an excellent job as Peter Parker. Uh, and Spider-Man 2 is, to this day, one of the best, or one of my favorite Spider-Man films, man, honestly. No other film, uh, ma no other Spider-Man film matches that, obviously. Uh, but we're going to see if Homecoming uh, does that. We're going to see if Homecoming is going to be better than 2, man. I'm, I'm, I'm going to try to go in without a bias. <laughs> I know some of you guys are probably rolling your eyes like, yeah, right. I'm going to try to go in with no with, with, with no bias towards um, Spider-Man 2. You know, I'm going to give uh, Homecoming a, a fair chance to be better than um, Spider-Man. Uh, I'm going to give Spider-Man Homecoming a, a chance to be better than Spider-Man 2. I lost my words there for a second. And we'll see what happens, man. But, hey, lay off my man Tobey Maguire. Stop hating. He did a great job. Spider-Man 3 sucked. We all know it. But Spider-Man 1 and 2 were really great, man. Really, really fantastic. Some some would even say that Sam Raimi's uh, movies actually set the tone for every other MCU um, movie that we've seen thus far. So, I mean, those are great. Those are great movies, man. And all this whole thing about, oh, we get a kid, Spider-Man. He's in high school, blah, 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 blah. I'm like, dude, there's nothing wrong with an adult Spider-Man. The adult Spider-Man also had issues and problems. And I mean, he was dealing with things that you and I would deal with on a daily basis. On top of that, he's a freaking superhero. So, I mean, it's like, come on, man. I, 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 I am able to resonate and relate with Tobey Maguire's Spider-Man. Not so much with Tom Holland, especially of the whole high school scene. Uh, high school has changed since I was in high school, uh, I don't know, 10 years ago. But yeah, man, I'm excited for Homecoming. Stop talking about my man Tobey. He did a great job. Tom Holland is doing a great job. And actually, I thought Andrew Garfield did a pretty solid job, too. Actually, I think Andrew Garfield did a really good job. All of the films were, were not good. Uh, I think they are solid, but they are borderline guilty pleasures. Um, but yeah, man, those are my little two cents on the Spider-Man Homecoming. I'm really excited. If you're excited, let me know in the comment section below. Drop a like on this video. Hey, and click that subscribe button. I'm trying to hit 100, man. Help a brother out. Peace.